Welcome back to my channel. This is Donnie and you're watching Diamond Painting by Donnie. And today I've got a little bit of an unbox uh, bagging to do. Um, I'm getting ready to do a live show and tell video pretty soon. And I had some time to kill so I thought I would do some unboxings and get these done. Um, this, there are two diamond paintings in this package. It is um, from a store called Sunbeam on AliExpress. Um, they cost different each one, but uh, it, this was sent small packets, so it took a little longer to get here. I ordered them on January 5th. They shipped January 10th, and I received them February 5th, so it took 31 days to get here. Now, they're both rhinestone. I will pull the first one out, and then... Okay, so I do have it. This is a picture that I have had um, wanted to... I've been wanting to do it in one form or the other but I just never could get myself to purchase it because it wasn't something my style so much um, but here is the image I call it the rhinestone flower girl and I'm sure you've seen this image before um, I did pay three dollars and fifty cents Sunbeam is one of those shops that has a lot of these partial round um, partial obviously round rhinestone paintings so I'll link them down below and I do have a lot more coming from Sunbeam in future videos. So let's look at this here. Um, it has nine colors. Doesn't look like there's a lot of the area that is... Um, oh, okay, wait. The flowers in the hair are done. I was thinking because they didn't have letters, they weren't um, done. But like I said, there's only nine colors or shapes. So... There's not a lot, but it's supposed to be a 30 by 40. Obviously the image is not, is not 30 by 40. It came with, okay, it did come with wax. It came with the black tweezers. And my hands are really cold or I would take this off my hand. I love this shirt. All right, here we go. Um, it, the folds weren't too bad. They're not creased too badly. Um, it's not curling up on me or anything. Here are some of the areas that put, you put the shape, special shapes and you can see where the rhinestones will go all down her hair. And then more flowers are done throughout here. And it looks like all the flowers in her hands are done too. And the hair is big. There's a lot of hair, so it goes all the way down the hair and the flower area down the back. Uh, so it looks like there's two special shapes and the rest are rhinestones, but one of them actually looks like it's a special shape. Those half opals are considered special shapes too. So let's look at these. They're linked together, except for, I've noticed that a lot of the time they put the special shapes in separate bags. Yeah, so there's three that are in separate bags. So the flower, these will go in the flowers. Um, YX058 is the dash, so that, yeah, that's up in her hair. These are the half pearls I was talking about. And here's one of the special shapes, this pink. I love how it's a full pink. It's not uh, just painted on. But these got this, have the silverbacks, and they're a smaller version of that one. So those are the three special shapes. And then we have <clears throat> six rhinestone colors. We're really pretty. Silver, your basic silver. And then a pink, green, light blue, dark blue, and then yellow. So for $3.50, you um, can't beat that. And because of the size, I'll be able to put it in my um, portfolio once I get it done. I'll measure it real quick just so we know the actual size of an image. It is, let's see, 24. So it took off six centimeters. 24 by, 
almost 34. Let's get it straight. Yeah, almost 34. So six centimeters on either side. Um, so there's three centimeters on each side that they counted for the shape, for the size of the image. So, yeah, I just, I would not put something like this on my wall. <clears throat> I don't generally put people, especially women, on my wall. Um, unless it's some from some kind of movie or something like that. And um, so there's this one. Nine colors, three dollars and fifty cents. I'll just turn this over because I don't have a lot of room here right now. Put that there. And this next one. This is more, you know, in the fantasy realm of something that I would do. I only purchased this one because it's got extra area on it. This one was $2.90 and it's a third, 20 by 30. So because it's got all this area to drill around here, that's why I went ahead and did it. Um, it's a butterfly girl. I mean, whoa, I named it rhinestone butterfly girl. And again, $2.90, 20 by 30. So let's see. what it looks like here. Get it out of the bag. There it is, there it is. Okay, so seven, co seven colors. Uh, looks like three rhinestones and then four shapes. Normally you can tell which one's a shape um, because it's got that, it kind of tends to give you this somewhat of the shape of that gem that it's going to be. But the rhinestones will be in circles most of the time. So this is a cute little size. I mean, under $3. It's a really good price too. I didn't mind even the fact that it took a month to get here because, you know, when you pay that little of an amount you got to kind of expect to wait. Um, but this area here and her hair is done and all these flowers as well. And this area down here, her whole wing and it's purple. So, you know, me in purple. Get that flat. And just because I know it's not 20 by 30, let's measure it real quick. Gonna be a short video either way. I don't want to get my shirt on the sticky. Okay, measuring tape. It is about 24. by well this is odd it's 24 by 24 well see here it says 30 by 30 on the listing it says 20 by 30 so so it's 24 by 24 so it's actually a little bigger than I was expecting which is fine because I was expecting 20 by 30 so it averages out but anyway it did the same thing it took off the three centimeters on each side for the, the size that it said it would be and again they have the wax uh, drill placer tray and the, the black plastic tweezers all right let's see so one of the special shapes are these dinky tiny little teardrop slivers which I was told by somebody to use a three placer to pick these up and place them um, with a three placer. So I'm going to try that. So that's number seven. Here's number five. Okay. These go on the wing. So I better not lose one because there's only two and it requires two, but look at how pretty those are. So pretty. Let's see if I can pull the other one up. Okay. And the other one is a half opal white with AB on it. 
Um, actually, there's another one. Oh, that's right, because there's only three rhinestone colors. Um, and now we have a purple sliver, teardrop sliver. And one of the one of the colors that's um, normally would be rhinestone. It's actually a half half opal, um, really that pretty purple with AB coating on it. Beautiful. Oh my gosh. And then there are two bags of number two, which is the purple. So that's the majority of the color. Look how pretty. And then a silver. So it's purple everywhere on this one. That's the color you're going to get on this. And this is something I could do rather quickly. Probably something for the car because um, I'm almost done with the one that I'm doing in the car. And because I have a living room project, my living room project and my main project are going to be the same thing. I'm, I made it to where I can take it back and forth between the living room and in here. So that's it for this um, unboxing. I hope you liked it. Um, be be um, looking for more rhinestone diamond painting unboxings from Sunbeam in the near future. But I have no idea when this video is going to post. So there's a lot in front of it. Um, but anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell if you want to be notified to be informed when I do post new videos and live chats. Um, have fun diamond painting, and I will see you in the next video. Remember to always sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do. Take care, everyone. Bye!